List of Puerto Ricans in the United States Space Program This is a list of notable Puerto Rican scientists involved in the United States Space Program, also known as the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, NASA, and their contributions to said program. This list is not limited to Puerto Ricans born in Puerto Rico. It also includes people of Puerto Rican descent born elsewhere. According to an article written by Margarita Santori Lopez for the official newspaper of the University of Puerto Rico's Meigs campus, Prensa Arium, as of 2003, of the 114 Hispanics working at NASA Goddard Space Flight Center in Maryland, 70 were Puerto Ricans or of Puerto Rican descent. Puerto Ricans and people of Puerto Rican descent, both men and women, have reached top positions in NASA serving in sensitive leadership positions. On May 6, 2004, Joseph M. Acaba became the first person of Puerto Rican heritage to be named as a NASA astronaut candidate when he was selected as a member of NASA Astronaut Training Group 19. On an average, only the top 4% of the qualified applicants are selected as finalists and are invited to the Johnson Space Center in Houston for interviews for a position in the astronaut candidate class. Out of the finalist group, an average of only 0.63% are selected to become an astronaut candidate. Other notable individuals who have reached finalist status include Nitza Margarita Cintron, astronaut class 8, 1978, Carlos Ortiz Longo, Astronaut Class 16, 1996, Figueroa Felicino, Astronaut Class 19, 2004, and Class 20, 2009, and Vanessa Pont Williams, Astronaut Class 20, 2009, and Class 21, 2012. The following are short profiles of these men and women. Contents: Top Joseph M. Acaba, Roberto Alemin, Adan Rodriguez Arroyo. Renan Borley, Antony M. Busquets, E. L. Alvarez, Chico, Nitza Margarita Cintron, Gilberto Colon, Juan R. Cruz, Carlos del Castillo, Lydia del Rio, Ray N. Diaz, Alfonso Eakin, Any Joseph M. Acabava, Acabava, Acabava. Astronaut. In May 2004, Acaba became the first person of Puerto Rican heritage to be named as a NASA astronaut candidate when he was selected as a member of NASA Astronaut Training Group 19. He completed his training on February 10, 2006 and was assigned to SD Minus 119, which flew from March 15 to March 28, 2009 to deliver the final set of solar arrays to the International Space Station. Statistics Roberto Alemin, Electronics Engineer, Aerospace Technologists, Environmental Instruments Director at NASA Goddard Space Flight Center in Maryland. Alemin directs everything that is related to the environmental instruments which the United States provides to the European Space Agency in order to operate the MET-OP, a European satellite that provides environmental information to both Europe and the United States. Vanessa Pont Williams, Ph.D., Chemical and Aerospace Engineer, Human Spaceflight Exploration Lead, Lockheed Martin Space. Dr. Vanessa Pont Williams is the Human Spaceflight Exploration Lead of Advanced Programs, Lockheed Martin Space. She has close to 20 years of experience in the aerospace industry, primarily devoted to human spaceflight and systems engineering. Prior to Lockheed Martin, she worked in the areas of advanced life support, as well as controls, dynamics, and propulsion at NASA Kennedy, Dryden, and Johnson Space Centers. She joined Lockheed Martin as a SR. Systems engineer in 2006, one of her most notable roles held within the Orion Multipurpose Crew Vehicle Program, where she led the cross-cutting integration team in tackling high visibility, short turnaround challenges. After Orion, Vanessa also led the new technology insertion board as well as oversaw the technical and programmatic scrutiny of critical U.S. spaceflight assets as risk and opportunity manager within the special programs line of business. Outside her career at Lockheed Martin, Vanessa has had the distinction 
of being selected as a finalist and undergoing the astronaut selection interview process at NASA Johnson Space Center twice 2009 and 2012. Throughout her career at Lockheed Martin, Vanessa has been intimately involved with leadership development, STEM, and volunteerism. She is also a former member of Rocky Mountain Rescue Group. Vanessa was born and raised in Puerto Rico. She received a B.S. and M.S. in Chemical Engineering from UPR at Meigs and a Ph.D. in Aerospace Engineering Sciences from CU Boulder. Adam Rodriguez Arroyo Electronics Engineer, Aerospace Technologists Stationed at NASA Goddard Space Flight Center in Maryland for over 20 years, Rodriguez Arroyo was the communications system lead engineer for the Lunar Reconnaissance Orbiter Mission LRO, launched in June 2009 and currently orbiting the Moon. Currently, Rodriguez Arroyo is the communications system lead engineer for the Magnetospheric Multi-Scale Mission MMS to be launched in 2015 and will study the electromagnetic iteration between the Sun and Earth. Rodriguez Arroyo earned his B.C. from the University of Puerto Rico and his M.C. from the Whiting School of Engineering at Johns Hopkins University. He was born in Penulas, Puerto Rico. Renan Borley Mechanical Engineer, Aerospace Technologist, Technologist Swift Satellite Instrumentation Manager at NASA Goddard Space Center in Maryland. The SWIFT is a multi-wavelength space-based observatory dedicated to the study of gamma-ray burst GRV science. Anthony M. Buscase Electronics Engineer, Aerospace Technologist, stationed at NASA Langley Research Center in Hampton, Virginia. His responsibilities include the development and application of multifunction control slash display switch technology in 1983 and development and application of a microprocessor based I slash O system force. NASA awards and recognitions. 1986 certification of recognition NASA Tech Brief publication. 1987. 92 certificate of recognition NASA Innovation Disclosure. 1992. NASA Team Excellence Award. 1993 certificate of outstanding performance. 1995-97. NASA Performance Award. He is the author and or co-author of over 13 conference papers and NASA formal publications in the areas of cockpit controls and displays, use of stereoscopy in flight displays and pictorial flight displays for situation awareness enhancement. Miel Alvarez Chico Computer Engineer Aerospace Technologist Suggests 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 System Hardware Design Engineer for the Aft Deck Simulator and the Cockpit Motion Facility at NASA Langley Research Center in Hampton, Virginia. He is also the Assistant Systems Engineer, General Aviation Simulator Reactivation Support of the Owen Research Study 1998-2002. NASA Awards and Recognitions. 1997, 2000 Achievement Award. It's a Margarita Cintron. Chief of Space Medicine and Healthcare Systems Office at NASA's Johnson Space Center. In 1979, Cintron was the originator of the Biochemistry Laboratory at the Johnson Space Center. Cintron also served from 1979-85 as the project scientist for the Space Lab 2 mission, which was launched aboard the Space Shuttle Challenger in 1985. Among the positions held by Cintron in NASA are Chief of the Biomedical Operations and Research Branch in the Medical Science Division and Director for Managing the Life Sciences Research Laboratories in support of Medical Op. In 2004, she was named Chief of NASA's JSC Space Medicine and Healthcare Systems Office, position which she currently holds. In 1978, Dr. Cintron became the first person of Puerto Rican heritage to become a finalist of the NASA Astronaut Selection Program. NASA Awards and Recognitions JSC Director's Commendation and Innovation Award, the Center's Highest Award for a Civil Servant, the NASA Medal for Exceptional Scientific Achievement, the highest science honor given by the agency. On October 7, 2004, 
she was inducted into the Hispanic Engineers National Achievement Awards Conference Hanak Hall of Fame. The Hall of Fame, located in Los Angeles, California, was established in 1998 and recognizes the contributions of Hispanics in the fields of science, engineering, and technology. In 2006, she was recognized as one of the 100 most influential Hispanics in the United States by Hispanic magazine. Gilberto Colon, chemical engineer, aerospace technologists, 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 Associate Director for the Sun-Earth Connections Programs. Colin is the director of the NASA program known as Living with a Star slash Solar Terrestrial Probes. He travels throughout the United States and Puerto Rico during the summers, instructing teachers of both private and public educational facilities. NASA Goddard Space Flight Center in Maryland. Juan R. Cruz, aerospace engineer, aerospace technologist, Mars Exploration Rover MER Parachute at NASA Langley Research Center in Hampton, Virginia. Cruz is a senior aerospace engineer in the Exploration Systems Engineering Branch at the NASA Langley Research Center. His responsibilities are focused on research and development of entry, descent, and landing EDL systems for robotic and human exploration missions. He was a member of the highly successful Mars Exploration Rover MER project that placed two rovers on the surface of Mars in 2004. His contributions to the MER project were centered on the design and qualification of the supersonic parachute. Cruz is also a member of the Phoenix Mars 2007, Mars Science Laboratory Mars 2009, and Crew Exploration Vehicle EDL teams. He has undertaken research on advanced missions to Mars, including robotic airplanes, as well as having been a technical reviewer for the Genesis, Hygens, and Stardust missions. Prior to his involvement with exploration programs, he conducted research on high-altitude unmanned aircraft. Cruz holds a Ph.D. from Virginia Tech and an S.B. from MIT, both in aerospace engineering. During his years at MIT, he was involved with the Monarch and D-Dallas human-powered airplane teams. Carlos Del Castillo, Program Scientist for the Ocean Biology and Biogeochemistry Program, NASA Headquarters in Washington, D.C. Del Castillo is the recipient of the Presidential Early Career Award for Scientists and Engineers PECACE Award, the highest honor bestowed by the United States government on scientists and engineers beginning their independent careers. He began working in the Mississippi River Plume and in the application of remote sensors to study coastal environments. Del Castillo co-edited with doctors Richard Miller and Brent McKee Remote Sensing of the Coastal Environment, a book which provides extensive insight on remote sensing of coastal waters from aircraft and space-based platforms Lydia Del Rio, analyst, 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 research and program management and center full cost program analyst at NASA Kennedy Space Center in Florida. Del Rio is responsible for planning and managing RNPM and for evaluating the effectiveness of its program efforts and for the allocation of resources and funds utilization. Ray N. Diaz, Engineering Management, stationed at NASA Kennedy Space Flight Center in Florida, Dr. Ray N. Diaz is a senior manager serving as the chief of the Business Systems Division at the Kennedy Space Center. Dias holds a Ph.D. in Industrial Engineering and a Master's Degree in Engineering Management, both from the University of Central Florida. Prior to joining NASA in 1983, Dias earned his B.S. degree in Electrical Engineering from the University of Puerto Rico, Meigs campus. For over 40 missions, Dr. Dias was instrumental in the integration and testing of spaceflight systems and instruments carried on board space shuttle missions. In 1991, Dias received the Silver Snoopy Award, one of the highest and most prestigious honors bestowed by the NASA's astronaut office, and flown aboard a space shuttle mission. 
and the NASA Management Award in 2017 for sustained and outstanding performance and contributions to the NASA spaceflight programs. An expert on management systems, Dr. Dias has delivered exceptional services and advice to institutional and organizational management. Dr. Dias led the successful implementation of the business management system associated with all NASA employees for the Kennedy Space Center. Dr. Dias has been recognized for his contributions to increase awareness toward careers in science, technology, math and science, and the impact of science and technology on society. Alfonso Eaton, mechanical engineer, aerospace technologist, technologist, assistant director of the engineering division of the Goddard Space Flight Center. In 1966, Eaton became the first Puerto Rican and graduate of the Mayags campus of the University of Puerto Rico to work for NASA. Eaton retired on September 2005 after 39 years of service to the space agency. NASA Awards and Recognitions 2000 NASA Medal for Exceptional Service 200 NASA Medal for Extraordinary Service Enictali Figueroa Fellashino Orlando Figueroa Mechanical Engineer, Aerospace Technologist, Technologist Former Director of Solar System Exploration Division and Mars Exploration and Director Applied Engineering and Technology as the Director of Engineering, he managed the full scope of engineering activities at Goddard, at Goddard Space Flight Center in Maryland. Headed the Cryogenic Technology Section, played a key role on the Cosmic Background Explorer mission, and managed a Space Shuttle Helium on-orbit mission. Manager for the Small Explorers SMEX Project, Manager for the Explorers Program, and Director of Systems Technology, and Advanced Concept Directorate. On August 1, 2004, was named Deputy Associate Administrator for Programs. In August 2005, Figaro was appointed to the position of Director for System Safety and Mission Assurance at the Goddard Space Flight Center. In October 2005, Figaro was named a Director of Applied Engineering and Technology at Goddard, as such, he is responsible for 1,300 employees and provides guidance on engineering and system technology. NASA Awards and Recognitions 1993 NASA Outstanding Leadership Medal for SMEX 1994 Community Stars Award 2001 Presidential Rank Award for Outstanding Performance as a Senior Executive 2002 Pioneer Award 2002 Hispanic Business Magazine named Ficoroa to its list of the nation's 100 most influential Hispanic. Guillermo A. Gonzalez is, is, Gonzalez is, is, O. A. Gonzalez is, Electronical Engineer, Aerospace Technologist, Technologists, In Space Propulsion Solar Sales Program Manager, Specialty, Electropyrochnik's Firing Circuit, and nickel cadmium battery systems at Langley Research Center in Hampton, Virginia. NASA Group Slash Team Achievement Awards 1989 90 Group Achievement Award as member of the Halo Instrument Team 1990 Group Achievement Award as member of the X-29 Drop Model Team 1994 Team Excellence Award for the X-31 Drop Model Program co-authored three publications in the area of aircraft flight testing. Olga D. Gonzalez Sanabria, chemical engineer, aerospace technologists, 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 logists, director of the engineering and technical services. Gonzalez Sanabria is responsible for planning and directing a full range of integrated services including engineering fabrication, testing facility management and aircraft services for the Glenn Research Center. NASA Awards and Recognitions 1993 NASA Exceptional Service Medal 2002 NASA Medal for Outstanding Leadership 2004 Inducted to the Ohio Women Hall of Fame NASA Glenn Research Center in Ohio Amri Hernandez Pellerano Electronics Engineer Aerospace Technologists Power Systems Electronics Designer at Goddard Space Flight Center in Maryland. Hernandez Pellerano Designs, builds and tests the electronics that will regulate the solar array power 
in order to charge the spacecraft battery and distribute power to the different loads or users inside the spacecraft. NASA Awards and Recognitions 2003 The GSFC Engineering Achievement Award for her design of the Power Systems Electronics for the MAP mission. Gloria Hernandez Physical Scientist Science Manager, Stratospheric Aerosol and Gas Experiment Roman 3 on the International Space Station Sage Roman 3 on ISS NASA Awards and Recognitions Over 30 NASA Performance Awards and Superior Accomplishment Awards 2011 Official Citation from the General Assembly, State of Connecticut in recognition for receiving the 2011 Latina Legends Award in Science and Technology from the Latinas and Power Symposium and for her commitment to the empowerment of women and breaking through barriers in science and technology. 2001 Recipient of the NASA Fellowship to Harvard Business School 2000 Southern Illinois University Minority Engineering Program Achievement Award 1998 The National Technical Association 50 Top Women in the Sciences Award Annie Dilgado Holton Project Control Specialist as a PCG Delgado Holton us responsible for the budget planning and analysis of a major portion of a program and or project for which she was selected. She provides support to the Exploration Systems Division ESD as member of the Project Control Office staff. Delgado Holton evaluates financial trends and determines compliance with project guidance at Glenn Research Center in Ohio. Gilgado Holton launched the first Esperanza Community Dialogue. Esperanza is a nonprofit organization in the Cleveland area whose main goal is to provide students with the necessary resources to excel in their college careers. Esperanza Community Dialogue brings forth to the Center Esperanza Scholarship recipients and their parents to learn and discuss the great opportunities offered at NASA GRC. Gilgado Holton began her career at NASA Glenn Research Center as an executive support assistant to the Aeronautics Directorate. She is also a member of Latina, and as a member she advocated for the inclusion of a Hispanic woman into the Ohio's Women's Hall of Fame. Lucas G. Horton, G. Horton, G. Horton, G. Horton. Aerospace Engineer, Aerospace Technologist, NASA Awards and Recognitions. 1990 Certificate of Appreciation, Outstanding Accomplishments Control Structure Interaction Program, 1987, 89, 94, 96 Certificate of Outstanding Performance, 1990 Group Achievement, Award Control Structure Interaction Mini Mass Team, 1990 Minus 92 Superior Accomplishment Award, 90. He is the author and or co-author of over 35 technical papers in the areas of system identification, vibration control and isolation, optimal control design and implementation, optimal actuator slash sensor placement, model testing, and experimental verification of control methodologies. NASA Langley Research Center in Hampton, Virginia, Ten Virginia, 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 Lafontaine, Information Technologist, Information Technology, IT Specialist at Glenn Research Center in Ohio. Part of Lafontaine's job is to assist in the implementation of federal IT mandates. She develops web based solutions to address information management needs. LaFontaine developed a dynamic web-based bulletin board called Today at Glenn, and she created a website documenting cultural change initiatives at Glenn. LaFontaine helped develop a NASA strategic plan for the advancement of Hispanics at the center. Javier Lecha, Electronics Engineer, Aerospace Technologists, Group Leader in the area of Electromechanical Systems at Goddard Space Center in Maryland. Maria C. Lechishi, 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 Electronics Engineer, Aerospace Technologists,
Lecce is in charge of a group of engineers who are in the process of developing the Solar Dynamic Observatory, which will be launched into outer space in 2008 at Goddard Space Center in Maryland. Carlos A. Lysaga, P.E.E. P.E.E. -E P.E. -E P.E.E. -E -P -E. Electrical and Computer Engineer, Aerospace Technologist, Explorer Acquisition Manager at Langley Research Center in Hampton, Virginia. For the Explorer program, leads the development of proposal guidelines and the technical management and cost evaluation of the proposals. Specialties, Fault-Tolerant Computing, Reliability Modeling, NASA Awards, 2003 Six-Time Off Award, 1995, 2003 Four, Five Performance Award, 2002 for a Special Task Award, 1999, 2001 Superior Accomplishment Award, 1998 Certificate of Recognition for Invention Disclosure, 1986 Special Achievement Award. He is the author and or co-author of 12 publications in the areas of reliability modeling, fault-tolerant computers, space systems, spacecraft simulation, shuttle-slash-station subsystems, and space mission proposal guidelines. Carlos Ortiz Longo, O. Longo, Mechanical Engineering, Materials Science and Engineering, Air Transport Pilot, and Flight Instructor. Dr. Carlos R. Ortiz Longo is a retired NASA Johnson Space Center engineer and pilot. His expertise includes thermal analysis, thermal design, high-speed atmospheric thermal protection systems, materials engineering, mechanical behavior of high-temperature structural ceramics, mechanical testing of materials, structural mechanics, astronaut crew health care systems, rocket engine testing, project management and system. Dr. Ortiz Longo is currently an airline pilot for a major airline. Dr. Ortiz Longo reached finalist status in the astronaut selection program top 4% of qualified applicants who are invited to the Johnson Space Center in Houston for final interviews for astronaut candidate class 16 in 1996. In 2005, Ortiz Longo was awarded the NASA Exceptional Achievement Medal. To be awarded the medal, a NASA employee must make substantial contributions characterized by a substantial and significant improvement in operations efficiency, service, financial savings, science or technology which directly contribute to the mission of NASA for civilians. The decoration is typically bestowed to mid-level and senior NASA administrators who have Astronauts may be awarded the decoration after two to three space flights. Among his awards, recognitions, and achievements are Silver Snoopy Award, 1991. Finalist, Astronaut Selection Program, Astronaut Candidate Class 16, 1996. NASA Exceptional Achievement Medal, 2005. Graduate of the NASA Leadership Development Program, 2009. Debbie Martinez, computer engineer, aerospace technologist, suggests, 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 expertise, flight simulation at Langley Research Center in Hampton, Virginia, 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 flight systems and software branch software manager for the new cockpit motion facility. Martinez's job consists of supporting La RC Langley Research Center researcher community with their particular flight research project studies utilizing the La RC simulation facilities. This involves understanding their problem domain, formulating possible solutions, allocating appropriate resources, and ensuring that the results satisfy their researchers' needs. NASA Superior Awards 1999 Outstanding Performance and contributions to the FWP Outstanding FWPC Representative, 1999 Outstanding Efforts in Overseeing the Final HSR Simulation Study at La RC, 2001 Support of La RC OP, 2001 Minus 2003 CMFDC6 Leadership, plus numerous NASA Performance, NASA Team Excellence, and NASA Group Awards. 1999 Latina of the Year Award in Science and Technology by Latina Magazine. 
Lisette Martinez. Electrical engineer, rocket scientists, scientists, dentists, 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 scientists, dentists, scientists, scientists, dentists, scientists, 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 dentists, scientists. Martinez is the lead electrical engineer for the Space Experiment Module Program at the Wallops Flight Facility, which is part of NASA's Goddard Flight Facility. She is responsible for providing electrical engineering support to Code 870 Space Experiment Module SEM program. She also is responsible for the testing of ground and flight hardware. Martinez works with students around the world, helping them with science experiments that will actually ride along on space shuttle missions and blast into space. Martinez was part of the team that launched a rocket from White Sands, New Mexico to gather information on the hale Comet in 1999. She was featured in the November 2002 issue of Latina magazine. Lords E. Miranda, 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 Miranda. Senior Program Analyst Miranda co-manages the NASA-sponsored Research and Education Support Services contract ISRES. These services include support to the process for soliciting and selecting research investigations for NASA funding, logistical support to workshops and conferences for sponsored research and education, and maintenance of an interactive Internet site and electronic database that allow for submission and storage of proposals and associated documentation. NASA Awards and Recognitions 2005, she was awarded the NASA Acquisition Improvement Award, AA, the highest agency acquisition award recognitions from EPA CSC, Government of Puerto Rico, the University of Puerto Rico, and from the Hispanic community in Washington, D.C. She was also featured in Time Po Latino, Washington Post. NASA headquarters located in Washington, D.C., Mayor N. Mentrosis, Mentrosis, is a Mentrosis, 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 Mentrosis. Executive Officer for the NASA Chief Scientist. Mentrosis is responsible for coordinating science policy at the agency at headquarters located in Washington, D.C. She works with representatives from the NASA research organizations to ensure that the NASA science policy is implemented as intended. She is also in charge of developing the NASA implementation to the federal policy on research misconduct. She works to ensure communication within the agency research programs and between NASA other federal agencies. Marla E. Perez Davis, chemical engineer, aerospace technologists, 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 physicians held, director of NASA's John H. Glenn Research Center, Cleveland, OH 2016 date, Deputy Director of NASA's Glenn Research Center, Cleveland, OH 2014 minutes 2016, Director of the Aeronautics Research Office at NASA's Glenn Research Center, Cleveland, OH 2010 minutes 2014, Chief Electrochemistry Branch at Glenn Research Center in Ohio. NASA Awards and Other Recognitions NASA Outstanding Leadership Medal, Presidential Rank Award for Meritorious Executives, 2015 Cranes Women of Note, Top 25 Elite Business Women Hispanic Business Magazine, Women of Color Career Achievement, Distinguished Alumni Award, Alumni Association of University of Puerto Rico Mayags, Comayags, Women in Aerospace Award for Aerospace Awareness. Women of Color Technology Award for Career Achievement 2001 Hispanic Engineer National Achievement Santiago Rodriguez Diversity Award 2001 Certified NASA Lean Six Sigma Black Belt Marla E. Perez Davis holds a Ph.D. in Chemical Engineering Mercedes Reeves Mechanical Engineer Aerospace Technologist Technologist Research Engineer at Langley Research Center in West Virginia. Reeves is responsible for the design of a viable full-scale solar sail and the development and testing of a scale model solar sail. 
She is also responsible for planning experimental studies to validate analytical techniques and study solar sales dynamics. Shayla Rivera Miriam Rada Navira Biology Aquatic Microbial Ecologist Senior Physical Sciences Technical Manager at Dryden Flight Research Center located in California, Radon Naviria is responsible for developing, coordinating, and maintaining research and educational activities in support of NASA DFRC mission. In 1995, she became the first woman minority branch chief within the National Exposure Research Laboratory. In 1998, she became the first Hispanic woman to hold the deputy directorship for the Environmental Sciences Division within the NERL. Miriam Rada Naviria holds a Ph.D. in Biology Aquatic Microbial Ecology. Miguel Rodriguez, Mechanical Engineer, Chief of the Integration Office of the Cape Canaveral Spaceport Management Office. Rodriguez is responsible for overall integration of CCSMO functions including assuring the effective base operations, maintenance, sustaining engineering, support services for all NASA at Kennedy Space Center KSC, 49th Space Wing at Cape Canaveral Air Base Station and Patrick Air Force Base, which is provided through the Joint Base Operations and NASA Awards and Recognitions. Two NASA Exceptional Medals, KSC Leadership Award and the NASA Silver Snoopy Award. Otilia I. Rodriguez Alvarez, Electrical Engineer, Aerospace Technologist, Solar B Mission Manager slash Geospace Instrument Systems Manager at Goddard Space Flight Center in Maryland. MS Rodriguez Alvarez began her career with NASA in 1986 at the Goddard Space Flight Center, Green Belt, Maryland, where she served as a test engineer with the Space Simulation Test Engineering section. She then transferred to the Guidance Navigation and Control Branch, where she worked on solar array and antenna systems for the Tropical Rainfall Measuring Mission TRMM and the X-Ray Timing Explorer XT. She later became the lead engineer for the Sensors and Actuators team on the Microwave Anisotropy Probe at Maypee. After leaving the Engineering Directorate, she became the Instrument Manager for the Advanced Baseline Imager for the Geostationary Operational Environmental Satellite GOES program. Currently, she is the Solar B Mission Manager and the Geospace Instrument Systems Manager in the Sun-Earth Connection Office. Otilia received her B.S. degree in Electrical Engineering from the University of Puerto Rico Mayigs campus and her M.S. in Electrical Engineering from the George Washington University, Washington, D.C. Pedro Rodriguez, Mechanical Engineer, Aerospace Technologist, Technologist, Director of the Test Laboratory in the Engineering Directorate at NASA's Marshall Space Flight Center at Marshall Space Flight Center in Alabama. Rodriguez is responsible for the engineering services and facilities for an environmental, structural, and propulsion testing of NASA programs assigned to the Marshall Space Flight Center. Among his duties are research, development, qualification, and acceptance testing of critical space and flight hardware, as well as the testing of relevant development hardware. Rodriguez invented a portable, battery-operated seat lift designed for people with degenerative knee arthritis to enable them to stand more easily. NASA Awards and Recognitions NASA's Exceptional Service Medal NASA Inventors Award The Silver Snoopy Award The Marshall Center Director's Commendation Award as the Outstanding Hispanic Employee the Puerto Rican Senate recognized Rodriguez with a resolution marking his engineering achievement. Pedro Rodriguez holds a Ph.D. in mechanical engineering. Rodriguez is the son of the late Puerto Rican salsa singer Pelin Rodriguez. Miel Roman, Earth System Scientist. Miel Roman is a research physical scientist with the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, NASA. A major focus of Roman's work is the quantification of uncertainty in long-term satellite measurements of the Earth's surface at both moderate and high spatial resolutions. Roman has developed a combination of global quality assessment and validation techniques that include visible, near-infrared, 
and multi-angular imagery and measurements acquired from in-situ and airborne platforms. His efforts to improve narrowband reflectance anisotropy models to estimate the bidirectional reflectance distribution function, BRDF, of land surfaces have led to major advancements in the estimation of terrestrial. As a lead member of the Moderate Resolution Imaging Spectral Radiometer MODIS and Visible Infrared Imaging Radiometer Suite VIRS, land discipline teams, Roman's research has enabled scientists to quantify how much of the variations in satellite observations are due to sensor performance, terrain and slash or geometry view angle effects, a critical factor when most recently, Dr. Roman's research has focused on capturing seasonal variations in nighttime lights using measurements from the Veer's day slash night band on Suomi in PP. Monserate Roman, Chief Microbiologist, Microbiologist at Marshall Flight Space Center in Alabama. Roman is the Chief Microbiologist for the Environmental Control and Life Support System Project. She determines how microbes will behave under different situations and in different locations, such as the nooks and crannies of the space station. She ensures safe water and air for the crew of the International Space Station. Carlos A. Gomez Rosas, Mission Director slash Ground System Manager, 2020 present, GeoCar Project, Ground System Manager, Germ, Manager, Germ, Manager, Germ, Manager, Germ. Manager, 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 2016-2018, Landsat 9 Project, Mission Operations Readiness Manager, MORM slash NASA Ground System Lee, 2011-2016, Mars Atmosphere and Volatile Evolutio and Mavin Mission, Ground System Manager slash Mission Director and Mission Ops Contracting Officer Rep, responsible for the operations of the NASA MAVIN mission as an end-to-end -end system to ensure that the spacecraft, the instruments, and ground systems are healthy, and that the science is processed and delivered to the scientists on the mission. Answer to the MAVIN primary investigator and the project manager. Work very closely with the spacecraft operations team as CT, and also with all of the mission interfaces, including the navigation team and AV, the Science Operations Center SOC, Instrument Teams, and the Deep Space Network DSN. 2009 2011, 2009 2011, Deputy then Lead Systems Engineer of the Gozar Ground System Project at Goddard Space Flight Center in Maryland. 2007 2009, Mission Operations Manager Gozo Project. 2005 2007, Program Director of the EDOS Project. Awards 2017 Honor Award Slash Group Achievement Award Mavin Mars Science Laboratory Curiosity Mars Exploration Rover Curiosity Relay Test Team 2016 NASA Exceptional Achievement Medal 2015 NASA Robert H. Goddard Exceptional Achievement for Engineering Honor Award Slash Group Achievement Award The Mavin Team 2007 Engineering Excellence Award, NASA GSFC Information Systems Division, for Outstanding Leadership and Exemplary Systems Engineering Support to the EOS Project. Originally from Carolina, Carlos attended Colgio Bostista, Escula Antonia Seas, and Escula Superior Berwind Berwind High School. Gomez Rosa has a degree in electrical engineering magna cum laude from the University of Puerto Rico slash Mayig's campus and a Master of Science in Electrical Engineering from the Johns Hopkins University in Baal. Carlos is now in his 33rd year at NASA. Yajera Sierra Saster, Ph.D. in Nanotechnology from Cornell University, Astronaut Applicant, Sierra Saster was chosen to take part in a new NASA project called HICs, an acronym for Hawaii Space Exploration Analog. She lived for four months, March 2013, August 2013, isolated in a planetary module, which simulated what life will be like for astronauts at a future base on Mars at a base in Hawaii. According to Sierra Saster, part of the food study will include an attempt to control the exposure to fresh air, evaluate how their senses of smell and taste change over time in isolation, and find out what role food plays in the crew's spirits and state of mind. 
Sierra Saster is an aspiring astronaut. Desiree Santa, Administrator, Congressional Liaison Slash Research Opportunity Administrator, at headquarters located in Washington, D.C. Management Analyst in the Office of Earth, performing analytical and evaluative work related to the management, organizational efficiency, and productivity of program operations. Juan A. Roman Velasquez, Velasquez, Roman Velasquez, 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 Men Velasquez, 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 Roman Velasquez, Mechanical Engineer, Aerospace Technologist, Knowledgist, Space Projects Formulation Manager at Goddard Space Center in Maryland. Roman Velasquez is in charge of a group of scientists and engineers who are the developers of the advanced concepts used in the space missions and whose technologies are to be used in telescopes and interferometry missions. Felix Soto Toro, astronaut applicant, electrical designs engineer at Kennedy Space Center in Florida. Soto reviews designs, builds tests, and implements engineering designs used in the Space Shuttle and Payload Operations Development Laboratories. The main project he developed was the Advanced Payload Transfer Measurement System ASTEMS Electronic 3D Measuring System, which consists of a simplified NASA Awards and Recognitions. Soto Toro was presented with the 2003 El Premio Cacui by La Casa de Puerto Rico in Florida for his outstanding contributions in the field of science. On November 9 of that same year, Soto Toro, along with another Puerto Rican astronaut applicant, Henry Bercy in Berrios and Ninfa Segura, who was the first Hispanic deputy mayor of New York City, were named the Grand Marshals of the Puerto Rican Day Parade held in Palm Bay, Florida. Adolfo Figueroa Venus, NASA's Bonzo Award, John Rivas from San Juan, Puerto Rico and creator of the comic strip Bonzo, designed some special Bonzo strips commemorating NASA's achievements, including Beyond the Moon, a calendar of the year 2000 honoring Hispanic heritage. NASA also instated the Bonzo Award, a pint-sized Bonzo statue, that will be given annually to the individual who makes the biggest contribution to NASA's Hispanic program.